yes, yes, it's Saturday. As you can see, it's kind of rainy. But we got to get that money. We got to put in work. We got to be there for our county. And you know, yes, yes. If you didn't know who this is, this is Mr. Yee Yee from that big 707 in Northern California, Solano County, you know, AKA Rudy. And uh, today, this morning, it's a little bit rainy, but it's gonna be a good day because today we're doing trailer rental. Trailer rental and drop off. So, you know, that's one of the services that we offer here at No Limit Hauling and Junk Removal. Trailer rental. You can rent our trailer. We'll drop it off in front of your house and we'll pick it up at a certain agreed time. And, you know, that's just it. It's easy peasy. All you have to do is reach out to us. Just like that. Yes, yes. But today, we're dropping this trailer off to these nice clients who need our help. It's a multiple uh, trailer load. They're probably going to need two loads, two, two trailers. And uh, no problem. So, you know, we have the trailers. No problem. We're gonna go drop this one off, and if they need another one, we'll, we'll come back and pick this one up and drop off our other one. No problem, just like that. The, avail the availability by having multiple trailers in your game, you know, is helping out us big time. And you know, that trailer is paying for itself all the time. And uh, you know, today's an easy day, even though it's rainy. I don't mind working in the rain, because I love wet money. Wet money is good money. So I actually like it when it rains even more though. Because when it's raining like this, everything that people want to get rid of that's in the backyard, the side of the house, you know, front of the house, it just gets more and more stinky and damaging. So I love when Mother Nature cleans the land because she makes people think like, man, I was trying to get rid of that stuff. Then they call us in. So, you know, but that's what we're doing this morning is Saturday. We're doing an early morning, early morning uh, trailer rental drop off. And that's what we are doing today. We are blessed. And you know, even in the rain to make a little bit of a, a little bit of a piece of the pie. So, you know, this is what we're doing. And uh, we're documenting it for you. Letting you guys know how to, you know, you can also do it even if you have a little trailer, whatever trailer, even if you have a truck, you can rent your truck. People, are, people will, will, well, use your truck if you have a long bed or if you have a truck you want to rent out people will use that too you'd be surprised what people will will rent these days instead of by having using their own stuff just a little bit of game for mr yee yee you know it's early morning it's saturday as you could probably hear the rain it's rainy but not in here it's so cozy but you know it's just that's what we're doing over here at no limit hauling and junk removal today we are doing trailer rental we're gonna go drop off this trailer right in front of their house. We don't leave the trailers on the street. We drop them, we drop them on the driveway, lock them up, and keep the key. And just like that, we'll be back to pick it up and get paid. And you know, I don't know how you guys charge your rentals or how you guys charge by the trash, the, the, the tonnage, but you know, reach out to me if you need some answers. If you need if you have any questions, make sure you like and subscribe. And, you know, reach out to me if you need some information on, on uh, you know, the whereabouts of this type of situation. So we can help you out and you can make even more money by, you know, renting your trailer when it's not in use. If it's, if it's just sitting there, uh-uh, let's get that trailer in use and start renting it out. Start promoting, you can have a, start promoting uh, uh, rentals from your equipment, no problem, you know. And, uh, you know, it's, it's easy peasy, trust me. But, uh. We'll get back at you when we get to this client's house. And we'll get back at you. Have a good day. We'll see you later. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. So we're back. We just dropped off our trailer. And just like that, you know, when I get to my client's house, I like to contact them. I don't like just dropping my trailer off. I love to get in contact with them and have them come out and guide me and let me know how they want the trailer. If they want it sideways, straight, whatever they want but it cannot be on the street or covering the sidewalk because 
there's code enforcement and you cannot block the sidewalk in case there is you know somebody with dis uh, 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 disabilities such as a wheelchair or a walker or a scooter or anything you can't block this but uh, the public city sidewalk that's just it so make sure you're above that and you know lock it up i put the lock on it on the wheels and the uh, hitch and you know make sure you take a picture of the credit card get the credit card on file everything on file so you know you know what to charge them in i don't know how you guys do your billing cycle but you know i keep their credit card on file so you know i have full control of everything and you know uh, here's a here's a little bit of a here's a little bit of some more game what i recommend you do is when you have jobs like that when you have jobs like that and they want a trailer rental and they want to reserve that day for that whole trailer that whole day or hopefully sometimes they can call you and be like we're done come get it we don't want it no more you can make it before the dump closes and you can go low unload it i mean dump it boom bam done and you know ask them if they have appliances ask them what they have and make sure you bust down to them the rules no hazardous materials no dirt no concrete no stone you know no paints no oils and you know no nothing like that no paints no oils and you know just make sure you tell them that otherwise you know they won't know and they'll just start throwing everything in there and uh, you know get them like that and uh you know what you could do is you know because you know a lot of people these days they love to reschedule they see the they see it's rainy and they're like oh man no nah, we can't do this today you know but a lot of people want to get the job done so they don't care but what i do what i recommend you do too get a deposit so if they want a trailer rental, I require, you know, $75 as a deposit, non-refundable. So if they do try to reschedule on you, you still have the $75 and, you know, or charge them your minimum. Whatever your minimum fee is to come out to pick a minimum item up, that should be your deposit. So in case something does happen and they cancel or later on in the week and they say, no, Rudy, we can't do it today. You still have that deposit unrefundable and that's just it and you know i recommend you know get a contract get something in writing and you know have them sign it and therefore you have a legal document that you know you have an illegal agreement and it's an illegal dot it's a document saying that this and that this and that refundable non-refundable no paints no oils or you know you will be charged if extra I let them know don't don't go over the brim don't go over the border the border is that shit they asked me about a mattress i said what you can do with the mattress is stand it up and i'll allow that that's it i won't allow you to do anything else mattress is totally understandable i will allow you to do that but other than that that's it but what i seen what they had pretty easy peasy so sometimes you'll get those those jobs where they just want that and they just want to make sure that they have enough room but you have a minimum charge and that's it and you know but just a little advice from your boy mr yee yee and you know easy money we are blessed to even get a paycheck on the on, on, on a rainy day on a rainy day we're just blessed to even get have a job on a rainy day and you know in the rain people change their mind a bunch of other stuff but Sometimes in the rain, you know, I get a lot of jobs too in the rain. People call me and be like, man, do you pick stuff up today in the rain? Be like, yes, I do. You know what I mean? I got my raincoat. I got my crew. We're on call. You know what I mean? We're, we're like those F-22s. We're on call. <sighs> Once you call us, we're gone. Let's go. Let's go. You know what I mean? But instead of devastation, we unstress. We declutter. We get your space back. We help you out. So, you know, it's a beautiful thing. Easy money today. Very easy, easy, easy peasy. And, you know, just like that. And that's just, you know, that's just, that's how it goes. And we're blessed. And, you know, uh, another trailer rental drop off. Just a little bit, you know, knowledge, junk removal, education on, you know, for you guys out there. How easy it is how easy it is that's another way of upselling yourself another way of getting more money and another way of getting smart easy money by having a trailer rental if you only have one trailer hey handle your business do, 
do that too. Go, uh, go, uh, you know, go drop that one trailer off. And, you know, hopefully no calls come in. Because if some calls come in and they say, hey, no, I want it done today. Guess what? I'm going to get that call. Not you. But, you know, some people know how to talk to people. And some people are very good with sales. And some people are very, very good with scheduling and, you know, being able to, you know, even though their trailer's busy, still book it in. And talk to the people and say, hey, if you could wait till tomorrow, I'll give you a discount. If you could wait till day to day, if you could wait till tomorrow, if you could wait till Monday, I don't do that. You know what I mean? I'm available. Multiple trailers. You know? So, it's all about growth in this business. It's not about staying at the same level. It's not about staying at, you know, I'm I'm, I'm, I'm happy with this level right here. Uh-uh. I'm happy with this level way up here. There's no limit to my level. You know? But I don't want to go so mainstream where all I'm doing is paying bills. All I'm doing is, you know what I mean, taking care of other people and not taking care of myself. You know what I mean? So, you know, I love being the truck and trailer. And, you know, that's it. It's a very, very, very basic business. You know, some of us are going to make it. Some of us aren't going to make it. You know, some of us are going to get more jobs. Some of us are going to get less jobs. But, hey, every bit helps. I'm getting money even in the rain right now. Even in the rain, I'm getting money right now. So, you know, I'm just blessed and just, you know, thank you, Jesus. G-I-G, God is good. And, you know, that's it. And, you know, but only because, you know, your boy right here at No Limit Hauling, I offer many services and I wear many hats. There's a lot of things that I do that a lot of people won't do. And, you know, a lot of people, a lot of people tell me all the time, Rudy, I don't know how you run around with a chainsaw. <laughs> I run around to get that money. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna just gonna uh, 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 lower myself just to a one payday. I'm not. I only do this. I only do this. I do multiple. I wear multiple hats. You know what I mean? Like the hat store. I got multiple hats. You know what I mean? And services for sale. So you know, I'm here to get that money. I'm not here to, you know, uh, uh, limit myself and say no. I only do that. But what I ain't gonna do is let a client lowball me. Or what I ain't gonna do is give those prices over the phone when I could just go there in person. <laughs> And most of the time I get the job. But you know, that's just it. You know, hopefully this is you learn from your boy, Mr. Yee Yee. And you know, learn something. Hope you hopefully you learned something new today that there's so many ways to get money. Just choose so many of them. And you know, get your money, you know what I mean? Handle your business. You know, like I said, it's raining and we're still getting money, and we're so blessed. And you know, rainy days, look at that, rainy day schedule, and we're still getting money. So, you know, we're blessed with that. With that said, trailer rental. And, you know, hopefully you guys liked it. Make sure you like and subscribe. Support the movement. Let me know what you think about this video. Let me know if you're doing trailer rentals out there. Let me know what you charge for your trailer rental. You know what I mean? Let me know what you, how much money you made today with your trailer rental. You know, don't be shy. You know what I mean? Put your pride to the side. And, you know, uh, communicate with Mr. Yee Yee. I talk back. There's so many haulers who call me and message me and, you know, ask me for my information. And guess what? You can ask every single one of them. And, and there's a lot of them watching right now. I'm always there for them. I pick up the phone. And they're so surprised when I say, yee, yee. They love it. You know what I mean? And that's just who I am. I love saying it. I love doing what I do. You know what I mean? And that's just it. Everybody have a good weekend. It's Saturday. Let's still get that money over in Northern California. It's rainy, but we're still getting that money. And, you know, it's nothing but love out here. Northern California, Solano County. Again, that big 707. And this is your boy, Mr. Yee Yee.